Hello everyone, Elaine Co. reporting for AvWeb from AirVenture 2015 in Oshkosh. We got an update today on Technum's P2010, which is awaiting FAA certification. They've already delivered about 25 aircraft in Europe under the ESA certification, and according to Technum, it'll be any day now. Well, the FAA progress is they actually made their trip over to Capua to verify the IAZA type certificate. Good news for us as well in the U.S. is that when they went over to look at the IAZA certificate, they had actually already just completed uh, the update to that certificate allowing the constant speed propeller so that now when they come in and we have our uh, FAA validation, we should have our constant speed prop available in the U.S. as well. As soon as it is, we already have delivered 25 aircraft in Europe under the same IAZA types if it's being validated. So we're able to go ahead and just basically divert a few slots here to the U.S. immediately. So we already have the aircraft. We already have the production line. It's outputting quite a few aircraft per month. We're just going to then start bringing some to the U.S. So our base price is 345000 That's for the G1000. That's the only way we're really going to the market in the U.S. Um, and that will be uh, the Lycoming IO360 M1A engine in that. Our maximum cruise is 140 knots, but everybody always asks me, what did you really get? So at this one, I flew up here pretty much gross most of the way. I flew at about 2,500 RPMs on the propeller. That put me at about 134 knots, true. I ended up burning about 10.5 gallons per hour for the whole flight, and that's the, just, just under 11, really, uh, for the entire flight. That's pretty darn good if you ask me.